ATI is really pushing the envelope of technology with the R300. Some of the capability that's going to offer uh, will allow us to do things for the, for the first time that we've, we've never seen before. At Turbine, we're always trying to take advantage of the latest and greatest graphics technologies. Uh, a game like Asheron's Call 2, we've really sort of pushed the envelope uh, as far as graphical image quality goes. Uh, a card like the R300 really helps us achieve that level of performance and image quality that we're really looking for in our games. The R300 will allow players of Asheron's Call 2 to play the game the way it was meant to be played, with all the graphics detail options turned up high. The image quality that we saw with the R300 was by far the best that we've seen running with the turbine engine. When we've seen brand new technology for the first time, obviously we get very, very excited. So when we first got our hands on the R300, we're looking at how fast it goes, how crisp and clean the image is. This is a card that we would absolutely recommend to anyone who wanted the state of the art in rendering technology on their PC. This card is, for us, really the first card that supports the full DirectX 9 feature set, which allows us to do all of the next gen, all of the new and most amazing things you can do graphically on your computer to date. You know, we've found that um, ATI has been very, very good to us. They've been very helpful. Uh, their driver support has been incredible. We found their cards to be incredibly stable. So, you know, clearly ATI to us is a key player in our development process. When people see the R300, they're going to be blown away, period. It's amazing. Uh, through the development of Doom, we've been working closely with ATI to make sure that all three generations of their applicable products are going to have good support for the game, and we're working closely with their driver writers to make sure that we get optimal performance out of the hardware. The R300 is an ideal rendering target for the Doom engine. It can do both our highly complex pixel shaders for light surface interactions, and it can very rapidly render all the stencil shadow volumes, which deal with all of our dynamic masking away of light operations. 3D accelerators are all about performance, quality, and flexibility, and the R300 breaks new ground over anything that's come before it in all three areas.